China's Communist Party work office in Taiwan denounced on Tuesday the Democratic Progressive Party's separatist actions and collusion with the United States. The work office denounced in a written statement the visit to Taiwan by the Speaker of the U.S. House of Representatives Nancy Pelosi and considers it is a move of egregious nature with serious consequences. The statement also stressed that the visit gravely infringes on China's sovereignty and territorial integrity, severely violates the One China Principle and the Three China China, U.S. joint communiques, seriously tramples on international law and the basic norms governing international relations, breaks the serious political commitment the United States has made to China, and sends a seriously wrong signal to forces seeking Taiwan independence. Pelosi started an official tour around Asia on Monday with a visit to Singapore and Malaysia, and is expected to conclude also and to include also South Korea and Japan. Chinese government's reaction to U.S. House Secretary Nancy Pelosi's visit on Tuesday to Taiwan begins to, trans begins to translate into concrete economic measures against the island. A Chinese Commerce Ministry spokesperson said the export of natural sand to Taiwan will be suspended from Wednesday according to relevant laws and regulations and China's General Administration of Customs announced that mainland's imports of citrus fruits, shelled white hairtail, and the frozen horse mackerel from Taiwan will be suspended also as of Wednesday, August the 3rd.